Hello once again and welcome back to this Let's Play of Eternal Darkness at his Requiem. Previously we were still playing as Anthony and uh, we had to kill the bishop because he had the key to get to the Charlemagne and apparently the bishop's evil, who would have guessed. Um, yeah, I had to pretty much run away because I ran out of time. Um, oh yeah, I'm going to kill these guys. Should I kill them? Oh well, okay. Now, when I was fiddling around with settings because my frame rate was getting really slow again, I noticed something when I was just standing around. Oh, he's back up. Oh, damn it. I'll show you in just a sec. I was going to kill this guy. Kill this guy. Right. Right. And kill him. Kill him. We don't want him to get back up again. He obviously gets in the way. I'm just going to show you something. I've never seen this happen before in the game. I just have to stand here for like 30 seconds or so, 20 seconds. So um, I'll just talk about something while we wait. Look, he's not. Oh, here we go. He, he doesn't know. Look. Watch this. What the fuck? I've never seen him do that. Holy shit. He just stabs himself through the hand. <laughs> uh, yeah, he's really not fit. Look at Look at Oh, he's losing his hair and he's got blisters all over his face. Pretty sure I still can't die. I should probably test that theory later on. Alright, come on. He's over here. Look at the wall. I mean, don't look at the wall. Look at look at in front of you, dumb man. Alright, and this one too. Alright, and... As you can see, the screen's all warped and everything, because our sanity's apparently really low. Alright. And these guys too. Come on. And then stab him. And this guy too. Oh, now we get the creepy music, because Anthony's sanity is in trouble. Alright, we're done here. Let's just leave. Yeah, don't worry about them. I get the feeling of sanity effects. <laughs> oh, I'm about to kick in. I'm slightly on edge. Uh oh, no, first we get one of these. New enemy type. These little shits. <sighs> I'm not sure if you can actually get by them. You have, to, you have to walk quietly here. Because setting them off makes them do their thing, which is really not. They're, they're deaf. Sorry, they're blind. But they're not deaf. So you have to sneak around them. Actually, you want know to screw it? I'll show you what happens if you set them off. Here we go. Hey, dude. You upset them and they teleport you away. That kills them, apparently. And you get warped to this place. Some kind of never realm or in-between dimension place or something. There's a positive side to this place. And that's, uh, you see those green and blue and red fountains? If you can time your teleports well, uh, you can actually recover whichever one that relates to. So, you know, red would be health, blue would be magic, green would be sanity. Uh, we don't want any sanity back, nah. So we're just going to ignore that for now. Uh, these teleports should change colour. Yeah, here we go. The travel dimension sprawls in every direction. Whilst in this place, magic cannot be cast and humans are subject to odd phenomena. The portals cycle from colour to colour as time progresses and only the quick will escape. So you have to time it properly. The first one's nice and easy on you. If you in here in a later level... Um, oh, quick! On it! One is purple! Uh, they might have like lots of strong enemies you'll have to fight as well. Right, the purple one always leads to the exit. So just step on here. There's the exit. So you want to try and avoid going here if possible, but if you do end up here, you can use it to your benefit if you can navigate your way. I think you can only recover one of the three, though. You can't recover all your health in the magic sanity and your magic. It's just one or the other. Right, let's leave here. Right, and now we're back. Hello again, everyone. Let's get out of this shithole. Trappers have no eyes, but can sense sound very well. If Anthony can sneak past them, they won't be trouble. So sneak past these ones too. Go away. No, don't come this way. Go around here. Oh, don't be one by the. Don't let there be one by the door. Oh no, we're good. We're good. But, oh, the whole place is upside down. Excuse me. This is not what I was hoping to find. I can't get out. I don't think. Hello? Can I get out? Oh. This can't be oh. It is happening, Anthony. Whether you like it or not. Oh, more of these guys. No. And there's going to be one up here too. Oh. I'll recover a bit of sanity. Cause I don't, like I said, don't want to get too low. Otherwise it gets really unhealthy. Die! There we go. I think that's all of them here. Are we almost there? I, I'm kind of lost track. And oh, no, I think we've got one more room. And then we're almost there. Right, open the door. 
Right. Can barely see in here. Oh, I think it might be a trap here. I'm going to go kind of quietly. I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't want to go really slow. This area is dark. I to make out any detail. Perhaps I've had a light source. Okay, I'll use my light source. Here we go. This should help. Why is my frame rate so low? Oh, torches are doing anything. It's broken. Oh, hey, guy. How you doing? You alright? Oh, it's getting worse. What's he look like now? Oh, all the skin's come off his mouth. That's rank. Uh, and that look. Don't look at me! Don't look at me! I hate the light. And he's limping along. Oh, there's a zombie here. Oh, it's the one I hit earlier. Have some fire, buddy. Can I finish him? No. I'm going to finish this guy because I think I may need um, the sanity back in a minute because things are about to get much worse for little old Anthony. And come on, come on, come on, get get it. There you go. Right. Oh, can I finish that one there? No. Oh, yeah, yeah, I can. There we go. And then this one over here too. This one here too. There you go. Oh, I think I'm having a bit too much sanity now. Whoops. My bad. I'm trying to do a low sanity round and keep fucking it up. Alright, let me just go up here. Right, before I go up, I'm going to enchant my sword. Even though it won't do much in this fight, it's better than some than none in this scenario. Because the, uh... Oh. The triangle of power is still relevant to our enemies in this game. You know, if you enchant your weapon with red, it'll be effective against green, but not blue. Uh, and this guy up here is going to be green. And blue is not going to give you much of a power boost, but it's better than nothing, to be perfectly honest. Right, here we go. Here he comes. Kind of a Jurassic Park moment here. Oh, it's a Velociraptor! Oh no, it's not. It's a big fucker with three heads. Look at that. Or is it eyes? Three eyes. These are kind of like the toughest monsters you face in terms of health amount. Um, depending on what colour they are as well, they can just instantly zap whatever colour they relate to from your meters. So this guy could just suck away at your sanity like no problem. Right, hit the head. Hit the head. That's it. Hit the other head. And the last one. Get. No, that actually went better than I thought. I think normally it would take like uh, two hits with a sword to take out an eye. But we're good. We're good. We did it. Right. Yeah, he's dead. I got the idea. Now we can head downstairs. Not going to cover any more sanity. I'm going to I'm going to try another reset. See if it goes a bit faster. No. No, it's just fraps being really shit today. Damn you, fraps. Right, just need to head down here. Are there normally monsters down here? Actually, yeah, I think there are. All right. We might be experiencing another sanity moment. Oh, I thought that one was going to miss. You two. You two. I think I've got no sanity left. Quick, finish him off. Finish. Finish. Finish the guys off. Come on, damn it. There we go. Oh, now you give me a faster frame rate, do you? Oh, it's gone again. Ah, oh, just for a moment. This game likes to toy with me. It'll sometimes give me a faster frame rate. And then it will go straight away. Right, here we go. We can now enter this room over here. Just use the key and we're good. Where did all the good guys go, by the way? Alright, use. Open door. That's the end of this one, I think. Poor, poor Anthony. You are a fool for trying to save him, Anthony. His fate was decided many centuries ago, as is the fate of this world. Despite your faith, there is little to save you from the power of Zealot. Oh, bet you didn't see that one coming. Those guys, we're going to fight them later on. And I hate them so much. What they do is they kind of, they just like you saw there, they burrow inside people somehow and take control of them. So then you kill them, they kill the, the host, and then you have to 
kill them, and they take away so much sanity. It's just, ah, uh, uh, I hate them. Right, Alex is kind of like, oh my god, I can't believe that happened. Oh uh, yeah. Right, I think we're done in this room at long last. Um, we actually have to go find the next scroll. Holy shit! Let's go do it. Have I actually got sanity yet for you, Alex? Oh yeah, just lost. Just a small bit. Just a little nickel bit. I don't think we get experience any sanity. Yet. Oh god, I forgot about those. They actually scared me slightly. Fuck. Oh, shut up. That's <laughs> just as I was saying. No sanity effects as well. Bah, 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 bah. Oh, shit. I was waiting for the time this game actually scared me slightly. Now no, I'm on edge. Where's the next scroll? Shit, I don't remember. Oh, God, is it time? I think it's time. Maybe not. I'm not sure. Those of you who have played this game will know what I'm referencing. Right. Oh god, <laughs> fucking... Don't do it here, please. Please. SHUT UP! Ugh. Right, uh, second floor key. Use. The key comes apart in the lock. The key to the second floor is broken. Perhaps there's a way of repairing it. Alex has picked up the broken second floor key. Oh yeah, we can still use magic that we learned from other characters during the course of Alex's story, so... Just go ahead and repair this. Uh, there we go, good as new. It's fantastic. Don't knock. Don't knock. It's no one here. Uh, this, the reason why this game is so fucked up is the kind of the psychological sides of it. Look, this statue is following me. This statue is following me. Stop it. It's because the sanity effects I feel, the psychological effects this game puts into your head of paranoia and just not feeling safe anywhere. I feel like once you turn off the game and you go somewhere else, you're still paranoid about nothing. There's nothing there, you know, because you're in your home, you're safe, but you still get paranoid like shit. Uh, that's what I felt, at least, anyway. That's what this game did to me. Right, pick up. Is he some... Alex has found some .38 revolver ammunition. Where's the revolver? Right, um, is there stuff in here? I can't remember. I know there's a scroll in here, I think. Alex questions the presence of a lush landscape and missed these morbid peaches. Uh, pe peaches? Was it peaches? Pieces. Could it be a single ray of hope encircled by the encroaching darkness? No. It isn't. Right, I think this is where I need to use the dresser key. I can hear mumbling. Detail. One of the drawers in the dresser curiously has no keyhole. In its place is a small triangle design flanked by a magical symbol. Uh, do I use this key here? I can't quite remember what I do next. Uh, definitely a dresser key. Oh, I think I need a spell. Um, this isn't going to work. No. Uh, oh, wait. I think I remember. Enchant the sword. And then you stab it. Like this. One of the drawers in the dresser curiously has no keyhole and places a small triangle design flanked by a magical symbol. No, stab- oh, I'd have to use it. No. Oh god, I thought you stab it and then- Oh, uh, forgetting things. It's not good. Um, do, 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 do. I'm not sure if I can actually open this yet. Maybe I can? Maybe, mm, let's check the bathroom, hey? I'm looking side to side, but you can't tell I am. Anything in here? <laughs> it <laughs> it lagged slightly, but you get the idea. That used to scare the shit out of me. That is like one of the famous parts of this game that everyone remembers because it's just so messed up. Right, pick up. Alex has found a page from the journal of Maximilian Roivus. I think we play as him later. Is this toilet full of shit or is it blood? I don't know, something like that. Right, um, I think I'm going to have to remind myself. Oh, there's blood on the wall. There's blood on the wall! Who's bleeding? I think I'm going to remind myself what the feck to do next because I can't remember. Check. Can I read this? I'll read it later. Got 30 seconds left. Excuse me, blood. I need to get through here. Excuse me, blood, mate. No, it's not gonna. It's not gonna open. I just want you stab it, and it opens. All right, I'm gonna remind myself what to do next. So uh, until next time, I'll remind myself what to do. Until then, see you later, and thanks for watching. Goodbye.